Welcome, Tug Addicts, to our video on Monica and I's trip down to New Orleans to Delacroix with Captain Norm for our Thanksgiving week of fishing, two days in Louisiana and three days at Keaton Beach. Give Captain Norm a call. He'll do a great job for you. He's a full-service guide. We were at the dock at 5.30 in the morning to get our shrimp after meeting with him, getting the boat loaded, all the gear on, we headed on to our next stop before hitting the water on our first drop, which was around six o'clock in the morning. And we were catching fish immediately. Here's where we picked up our shrimp before we went out. He will not only get you shrimp for your trip, and when you run out of those, you can go to using artificials. That was our plan. When we didn't have any more shrimp left, we throw artificials. Here's one of the most gorgeous shrimp we had, and they were all like that. I use a number one odd hook hook up before the brain, or if you like, you can go up to the horn as well. It just gives you a little more clearance on your hookup. Just Captain Norm going along. I'm telling you, I could never go back without a GPS. He you knows that area back of the sand. We've been down there before with John Adams, a buddy of mine, and it was so foggy one morning we could hardly see, but he got us through all the bayou country to our drive. He's slowing down here for a trip boat. He's very considerate of everybody on the water. You can see a couple of people set up in this photo. He slows down well ahead in order to go around them and not disturb the fishing drop. I wish all people were that considerate on the water. They don't realize they go to idle is much better than a wake behind them when they don't slow down too idle. Monica will get put on a big red in this next shot. Hi, right, sweetheart. Let's see you get that red in down here with Captain Noel. You got some action going on. That's right. We pull up here and Captain Noel said, throw over there, Monica, see if you can reach it. She threw the country mile against that bank and said, that's a good spot for a red. I think she's got a pretty good red on here right hey, now. Hey, it's Thanksgiving, right? That's right. It's a butterball. Butterball. I hope it's a big gold one. Turkey. Yeah, yeah my honey, that's another thing you don't see in Savannah. There'll be a lot more bronze looking here. Really? Yeah. And the deeper water you go in, the uh, more white they look. Uh -huh. like. And when we come back, we end up putting them in our live well when we do it, and we get back and they're completely white. Looks like a bull red you got on here, baby. Doing good. Okay. Don't be only Alright, you've only caught him fishing for one minute so far. Yep, minute and five seconds. No, you don't have to get him in in a hurry. People want to reel in so fast. Oh, I know it. They want to crank down like they got a Get one strike at it. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good fish, man. Did you? Right okay. Try throwing that X wrap on. Honey, normally you say at this point, my wrist is hurting. Going on two, you're going on two minutes. Take your time. This boat, he's gonna bug us. Uh -huh. I don't want to get in that net that Captain Norm has here. All right, let me back up a little bit. I'm gonna bring my pistol grip tomorrow for the oh camera. My God, he's big.
just pick your pole straight up. Easy man, sweetheart. Oh, All right. nice. Great job. Good nice. job, no, Good job, Monica. <laughs> uh, that could have been uh, textbook perfect there. Yeah, I thought it was going to run again. Well, I mean... Oh, well, I knew you were going to say that. You can take a picture. I may not have caught the most fish. <laughs> but you got the, the biggest one. Yeah, that's right. Hey. Right. Hold on just a second. Wait a minute. All right. You got it? Come got over a little closer there. Got me too. All right. These fish, guys, we had to cut a few more sheep's head today as we're fishing for trout and reds. And uh, Monica, show them the fish we got in the cooler there that uh, Captain Norm put us on. And here's the captain who put us on. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, the considering same. the weather today, which oh, we did yeah. pretty tough. We did excellent. Balmy weather still did well. Yeah. I had good fishermen with me today. Happy customer. <laughs> I had good fishermen. So Vince, you are getting Oh, this, the is sheep's head? A, this is a freshwater bass that we caught along with the speckled trout, nice reds, nice sheep's head. Even caught a catfish today in our rigs. And stingray. <laughs> we had a variety today. And that's what they call down here a mixed bag? A mixed bag. Mixed box, yeah. And mixed we box. got a lot of what they call down here rat reds. We threw back a bunch of those that we could have stepped on and made them legal. This is what we call stepped on legals. On these sheep's head, instead of coming up here like we normally do, it's really tough, guys. You want to come back here through the anal behind, up in front of the anal fin, go there, and then with this knife that I use, our, our curved edge fish knife, come through the front and pop through, and you can get your hand up in there and cut that main entrail out so your fish won't spoil on you. And Captain Norm's washing them, gonna pack them down and ice them down. Here, guys, are some of the photos that we took uh, the first and second days that we were fishing for the two days that we were down there before we went to Keaton Beach for the next three days during Thanksgiving week. That photo shows a big sheep's head, almost as big as the red. And not as big as Monica's big bull red that she had in this photo here. But we had a mixed bag. We had a great time. Captain Norm couldn't have done any better a job. The conditions weren't the best, but we still caught fish. Friends and family will be happy when we come home. Don't forget to take photos. It's not the fish you caught today, but the journey along the way. And we're on our way now to Keaton Beach. Coming out of Woodland, Louisiana, or Delacroix. Guys, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell. And also go to Captain Norm's Facebook page.